Angela Price from Eden Condensed Small Space Garden Design, and this is Garden Space. Today I'm going to give you a couple of tips on how to make a trellis for a squash or a cucumber plant on the cheap. So I've got some cucumbers here, and you can also do this for squash, although generally squash doesn't need to be trellised because it will grow more in a bushy habit, whereas cucumbers, which are related to squash, will tend to um, need something to vine onto. You'll see on the cucumber plants I have planted in this plastic tub um, that they're shooting out little tendrils and they're looking for something to climb up. If they don't get a trellis, they'll drape over the sides of the pot and the weight of the cucumbers can actually break the branches. So it's a good idea to provide some sort of trellising. Now you can buy uh, tomato cages or box trellises for them. You can also buy traditional wall type trellises. But sometimes what I'll do is I'll just look around my uh, garage or I'll look around my yard and see what I can turn into a trellis. So a couple things I found in my uh, yard adventures today is uh, some bamboo stakes. These actually came with a different plant that I had transplanted and took the stakes out of and attach the other plant and they've got a little wire on the top here. So this is a really great thing that you can put into your pot. It's also small so if you've got cucumbers in a pot so it's just a matter of pushing this down and then starting to train the cucumber vines around the bamboo stakes. If you've got uh, an old tree in your yard or branches that you've cut off from pruning a tree, you can also use the, the branches as well. And you can make a, a teepee size or just a V shape here. You can tie it with some twine or some wire to keep it together. Um, something else I found in the yard was a frame for a garage sale sign, which I don't know what happened to the sign, but I still have the frame. So instead of throwing this away, I'm going to use this, I can use this as a trellis as well, and it's great because it's got the little legs and I can just push this down and grow the cucumbers up from either side of it. So those are just a couple of options of things that I found in my yard. Uh, take a little scavenger hunt around your yard and see what you can do to make a homemade trellis for your, your vining uh, fruits and vegetables like cucumbers. And if you have any other questions or need some more ideas, please contact me at www.edencondense.com. Thank you very much.